At first, it was hardly noticeable, then a nuisance, and then something much more for Matthew Lohman of Ardmore. I had known that I had had a blank spot and didn't tell anybody for, for the longest time. It turned out that blind spot was caused by a cancerous tumor in his right eye. Dr. Brian Firestone of the Dean McGee Eye Institute made the diagnosis. Uveal melanoma, a rare, aggressive, and potentially deadly cancer. Time was of the essence. It is dangerous because it has the risk of spreading outside the eye to the liver and other places over time. In no time at all, Lohman was undergoing a cutting-edge surgical procedure, a custom-built gold disc called a plaque containing tiny radioactive seeds was placed in his eye directly over the tumor. And I uh, used some mathematical algorithms to um, calculate how much, the, how the dose is going to be deposited at the point where he wants the dose to be localized, the apex of the tumor. The plaque containing the radioactive seeds stays in place inside the eye for approximately four days and then is removed. A tiny sample of Lohman's tumor was also taken and sent for DNA testing. Those results brought a bit of good news in his cancer journey. He has an excellent prognosis for the tumor not spreading. Lohman has returned to his favorite pastime, a collection of antique fishing lures. Thankful he didn't wait longer to see a doctor about that pesky blind spot. I really relish the opportunity to um, see those patients and kind of walk them through that crisis in their lives. And um, so that's really why I do what I do. And Lulman is also grateful to the team of specialists who saved his eye and very well his life. The worst that could have happened is, is I could have died sitting on my couch not having known what was going on. But now there's, there's hope. That's the Dean McGee Eye Institute making news. I'm Teresa Green.